let's take a look at the investigate step of the problem solving model. Step 2 of our problem solving model, investigate, is where we gather information to define the problem. Much of the effort of problem solving involves understanding what the underlying issues really are, look for root causes, related information, ideas, risks, costs, and benefits associated with problems. Defining the real problem is the first major milestone on the way to a solution. It frequently takes as much time to identify and understand the problem as it does to solve it. When you investigate a problem, it's important to identify a few key elements of the problem. Here are three tools to use as you go. Problem solvers formulate how might we statements to gather the insights and struggles from the investigation and positively reframe them. Define your problem with statements using three little words. The how is solutions oriented, the might encourages optimism, and the we is collaborative. Use how might we statements as optimistic invitations to explore problems. The how might we approach to problem solving helps you innovate. You ask the right questions and use the power of language to help spark creative thinking and collaboration. How might we statements turn your challenges into opportunities? They're the culmination of gathering information about your problem. Some of the most successful organizations today are known for taking difficult, creative challenges by first asking how might we improve X, or completely reimagine Y, or find a new way to accomplish Z. The how might we question opens you up to uncovering and reimagining the need before you. It defines your problem and asks a clear, concise, and captivating question about it. The how acknowledges that you do not yet have an answer and helps you explore a variety of alternatives instead of jumping to a conclusion. The might emphasizes that there's more than one right idea and inspires you forward towards the opportunity to find them. And finally, the we suggests that your efforts in solving important problems require teamwork and collective thinking. How might we statements start with the words, how might we, and finish with a phrase or a question relating to the problem. Again, this is a great tool to define your problems. The goal is to gather as much information as possible about the problem, so it's helpful to generate a number of how might we questions. There are two important questions to ask yourself about your how might we statement. First, does it allow for a variety of solutions? If it doesn't, try making it more broad. And second, is it narrow enough to let you know where you should start your brainstorming? If not, try adding some helpful boundaries. The How Might We method is constructed in such a way that it opens the field for new ideas, admits that you do not currently know the answer, and encourages a collaborative approach to finding one. This is the best way to launch your brainstorming work. Identifying stakeholders, asking why five times, and how might we statements help you investigate problems.